Well, Bill and Candace, it could mean online classes for some and an extension of the school year next year for others. State education officials leaving the nuts and bolts of this decision up to local districts, although they will provide guidance uh, tomorrow. Many local education officials say they know this was a tough call and they knew it could be coming, but they still feel blindsided by the gravity of this moment. Many people had a vision for what 2020 would look like, but like the Vikings of Thomas Jefferson Hyde, everyone having to adjust because of COVID-19. This is fluid, it's dynamic, it changes every day. Governor Northam's decision to close schools for the rest of this academic year applies to both public and private schools. Education officials now working to make sure high school seniors on track to graduate will still be able to do so. We will be issuing guidance. Each school district will determine on their own how to wrap up this school year. And state education officials say they'll give local leaders multiple options to make up instructional time missed. In distance or remote learning, uh, uh, extending the school year next year, uh, embedding some of that instruction into the curriculum in the next year if they don't extend, uh, and uh, uh, maybe continuing instruction now, but maybe we can't get to every student equitably, just bringing some students back to make sure that we fill the gaps for students that, that were missed. Northam said he made this decision to close now based on a couple of factors. The spread in communities continues, the death rate increases. I worry about our capacity in our hospitals. Leaders from the biggest school districts in the Richmond Metro now asking everyone for patience. As students, teachers, and parents, enter a new phase of learning. Almost every single local school superintendent said they support this decision, even though they know it was a tough one to make. They'll be uh, communicating with parents about the next steps for this school year in the days to come after the Virginia Department of Education does send out that guidance. Now, meal pickups will continue. That's important. The governor is saying anyone with questions about that can text the word food or Comida, C-O-M-I-D-A, to the number 877-877. Again, text those words to 877-877 for information about meal pickup in your area. Working for you in Richmond, Jake Burns, CBS 6 News.